happy Saturday limited on time today so I wanted to do a quick video to talk about something that just came to my mind just while I was uh, exercising when life isn't 100% for you when you're not at the place where you want to be in your life you really need to focus your attention on getting better improving in your life maximizing your ability to take care of yourself and the people that are depending on you so if that means that you need to go to school you need to focus on school if you're gonna get training you need to focus on training if you're in a career and you need to make money to support your family you need to maximize your efforts at that now at the same time you need to be trying to find ways of creating a side income like I've talked about in other videos so starting a business working a second job preferably starting another business but maybe you need to work a second job to save up money because you have this idea that you feel like if put if you put the proper energy into it can make you a passive income or make you another income through income through an entrepreneurship idea but at the end of the day there are the specific things that we need to do to improve ourselves to make ourselves better to make our lives more efficient and if you take a, and place your attention in other areas rather than focusing on these areas of your life then what happens when life struggles start to push you into the ground and start to you know stomp all over you and take away your energy and take away your patience and take away your clarity of mind see some people tend to think that okay I can focus on drama I can focus on problems I can focus on how difficult my life is and I don't need to worry about improving myself this is an error that a lot of people make people may want you to do stuff for them that doesn't that's not more important than you improving yourself because if you can't take care of yourself then you can't take you're not even eligible to take care of other people if you can't take care of yourself so if there's something that you need to do because you need to increase your income or you're not gonna be able to afford your your uh, apartment you know anymore and maybe you know you're living paycheck to paycheck and you're tired of living like that you can't say oh well, I have to do these other things for everyone else rather than getting a second job so you can create a cushion for yourself or you can't go play around and have fun rather than trying to create that second income or you can't go around and play and have fun rather than working overtime on your job or taking shifts on your job or going out and mowing lawns or helping people these improvement ideals and these improvement opportunities should be your priority because as I've said in other videos your priority should be saving up money for you to have a retirement if you're living paycheck to paycheck you're probably not saving enough money for retirement even if you have a retirement fund that's usually not enough for people look it up research that topic research you know it our, our, our modern retirement funds gonna be enough money for you to live off of the rest of your life and not have to work probably not a lot of people are starting to understand that they may not ever be able to stop working because they didn't start saving early enough you know I'm kind of all over the place but what it all boils down to is take care of yourself first take care of your priorities first and then make sure that those priorities are being handled in a manner that is going to deliver you at a better end result you're getting older you know you need to be knocking out these things you know I met people when I was in college I met people that were much older than me 50 60 years old that had never finished college and I met people over and over again that were saying oh well you know I didn't go back to school because of these things they didn't prioritize school they didn't prioritize improving themselves are you hanging out this weekend or you could you be at a conference on networking and how to improve your your, your skills as far as technology you're concerned anything there's this you know I live in the Seattle area there's tons of different conferences and you know workshops and, and clinics and different things throughout the weekend that you could be attending that may make your mind hurt and may make you have to think hard but at the end of the day they're gonna deliver you at a higher cognitive um, level 
and improve your thinking and improve your options. You know, what would some sort of like web design month long course, what kind of doors would that open up for you as far as like being able to go out and do work for people or to get your, or to open up your own business um, or uh, be employed by someone that does that kind of work? I mean, just little things to think about going out mowing lawns, doing, you know, landscaping work. If you if you want to work with your hands, you know, um, doing, you know, construction work. I mean, anything, anything that's going to deliver you at a better like financial um, stability point. And then, you know, and then thinking past stability surplus, a surplus of money, a surplus of uh, money that you could use to build that passive income. So. Just, you know, think about it. Think about self-improvement. Think about what priorities do I need to put first and think about focusing on improving yourself and making your improvement, your personal improvement, a priority over trivial things in your life. Happy Saturday.